Welcome to the Travel Diaries. In this video we will explore 1. Best places to visit Argentina 2. Nature of Argentina 3. Foods of Argentina 4. People of Argentina 5. Beaches of Argentina 6. Nightlife in Argentina We made travel videos for you with very hard effort. We need your support, God bless you. Please like and share our video with your friends. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Best Places to Visit Argentina Argentina offers a wide variety of destinations that cater to different interests. From vibrant cities to stunning natural landscapes. Here are some of the best places to visit in Argentina. Buenos Aires Buenos Aires is the capital and largest city of Argentina, known for its vibrant culture, rich history, and diverse neighborhoods. Here's an overview of what you can expect when visiting Buenos Aires. Neighborhoods Buenos Aires is a city of neighborhoods, each with its own distinct personality. Some of the most famous neighborhoods include Palermo, known for its trendy bars, restaurants, and parks. It's divided into Palermo Soho and Palermo Hollywood, both popular nightlife areas. Recoleta, home to the iconic Recoleta Cemetery, this upscale neighborhood also features art galleries, elegant architecture, and cultural attractions. San Telmo, known for its bohemian atmosphere. San Telmo is famous for its antique markets, tango shows, and historic cobblestone streets. La Boca, colorful and vibrant, La Boca is famous for the Caminito Street and its artistic community. It's a hub of tango and culture. Microcentro, the central business district, where you'll find many historic landmarks, shopping areas, and government buildings. Cultural attractions. Buenos Aires is rich in cultural experiences. You can visit world-class museums like the Malba, Museum of Latin American Art, Museo Nacional de Bellas Artes, and the Museo de Arte Contemporáneo de Buenos Aires, MCBA. The Teatro Colón is one of the world's most renowned opera houses. Tango. Tango is an integral part of Buenos Aires' cultural identity. You can watch tango performances in theaters, attend milongas, tango dance parties, and even take tango lessons. Cuisine Buenos Aires offers a diverse culinary scene. You can enjoy traditional Argentine steaks at Parias, steakhouses. Try local dishes like empanadas and milanesas. And indulge in delicious pastries with dulce de leche. Shopping From high-end boutiques to local markets. Buenos Aires offers various shopping experiences. The San Telmo Sunday Market and the Palermo Soho Boutiques are popular spots. Parks and Green Spaces Buenos Aires boasts numerous parks and green spaces where you can relax and enjoy the outdoors. The Bosques de Palermo, Palermo Woods, and the Ecological Reserve are among the favorites. Nightlife Buenos Aires has a vibrant nightlife with options for everyone. You can enjoy live music, dance the night away at nightclubs, or simply explore the city's many bars and lounges. Historical Sites The city has several historical sites, including Plaza de Mayo, a political and historical center, Casa Rosada, the Presidential Palace, and the Metropolitan Cathedral. Events and Festivals Buenos Aires hosts a variety of events and festivals throughout the year, celebrating everything from music and film to food and arts. Local Culture The Porteño culture, the culture of Buenos Aires residents, is characterized by a love for soccer passionate discussions, and a unique sense of humor. Buenos Aires is a city that offers a blend of history, art, culture, and entertainment, making it a captivating destination for travelers seeking diverse experiences. Iguazu Falls Iguazu Falls, located on the border between Argentina and Brazil, is one of the most awe-inspiring natural wonders in the world. These magnificent waterfalls are renowned for their sheer size, breathtaking beauty, and lush surroundings. Here's what you need to know about Iguazu Falls. Location. Iguazu Falls is situated within the Iguazu National Park in northeastern Argentina. Near the border with Brazil. The falls are surrounded by tropical rainforest. Adding to the unique atmosphere of the area. Size and layout. The falls consist of approximately 275 individual cascades that stretch over nearly 2 miles, 3 kilometers, in a semicircular shape. The most iconic and impressive section is called the Garganta del Diablo, Devil's Throat, where the water plummets more than 260 feet, 80 meters, into a mist-covered chasm. Natural Beauty 
The falls are not only massive in scale but also incredibly beautiful. The combination of powerful water flow, mist, and rainbows created by the sunlight make for a mesmerizing sight. Iguazu National Park The falls are located within a protected area known as Iguazu National Park, which is home to a diverse range of flora and fauna. The park offers various walking trails that allow visitors to explore the surrounding rainforest and observe wildlife. Viewing Points There are several viewing platforms and trails that offer different perspectives of the falls. One of the most dramatic viewpoints is the Devil's Throat platform. Reached by a walkway that takes you out over the river to the edge of the falls. Boat Tours For a more immersive experience, you can take boat tours that bring you close to the falls. These tours often venture into the falls mist providing an exhilarating experience. Ecotourism Iguazu Falls is a prime location for ecotourism. The park offers opportunities for birdwatching, hiking, and exploring the rainforest ecosystem. Access The falls can be accessed from both the Argentine and Brazilian sides. The Argentine side provides more extensive access to the falls and allows visitors to get up close to the cascades. The Brazilian side offers panoramic views and a broader perspective of the falls. Conservation efforts. Both Argentina and Brazil have taken steps to preserve the natural beauty and ecological significance of Iguazu Falls and its surrounding areas. Visiting Iguazu Falls is an unforgettable experience that combines the thrill of natural wonder with the tranquility of a lush rainforest setting. Whether you're captivated by the sheer power of the falls or enchanted by the vibrant flora and fauna, Iguazu Falls is a must-see destination for any nature enthusiast. Patagonia. Patagonia is a vast and awe-inspiring region located at the southern tip of South America, spanning both Argentina and Chile. Known for its rugged landscapes, breathtaking natural wonders, and unique wildlife, Patagonia is a destination that captures the imagination of adventurers and nature enthusiasts. Here's an overview of Patagonia. Geography Patagonia is characterized by diverse geographical features, including towering mountains, massive glaciers, expansive grasslands, and pristine lakes. The Andes Mountains run along the western border, while the eastern side is marked by the Patagonian Steppe. National Parks The region is home to several national parks that offer opportunities for outdoor activities and exploration. Some of the most notable parks include Los Glaciares National Park, Argentina Known for the iconic Perito Moreno Glacier and the stunning Fitzroy Mountain Range. Torres del Paine National Park Chile, renowned for its dramatic landscapes, including granite spires, glaciers, and turquoise lakes. Tierra del Fuego National Park, Argentina Chile. Located at the southernmost tip, this park offers a mix of landscapes, from forests to coastal areas. Glaciers. Patagonia is home to numerous glaciers, including the aforementioned Perito Moreno Glacier, which is one of the few advancing glaciers in the world. Glacier trekking and boat tours provide opportunities to witness these icy giants up close. Wildlife Patagonia is a haven for diverse wildlife, including guanacos, a relative of the llama, foxes, condors, and various bird species. Marine life can also be observed along the coast, with colonies of penguins and sea lions. Hiking and trekking Patagonia is a paradise for hikers and trekkers, offering a range of trails for different skill levels. The W Trek in Torres del Paine and the trails around Fitzroy are among the most popular options. Adventure Sports The region offers a variety of adventure sports, including kayaking, rock climbing, and mountain biking. Wind and kite surfing are also popular along the coast. Remote Wilderness Patagonia's vast and remote landscapes provide a sense of isolation and serenity. It's an ideal destination for those seeking solitude and a connection with nature. Culture Patagonia has a unique cultural heritage influenced by indigenous peoples and European immigrants. You can learn about the region's history, traditions, and indigenous communities in various cultural centers and museums. Weather Patagonia's climate can be unpredictable, with rapidly changing weather conditions. It's important to be prepared for a range of temperatures and weather patterns, especially if you're planning outdoor activities. Sustainable Tourism Due to the delicate ecosystems and pristine environments, Responsible and sustainable tourism practices are encouraged in Patagonia to minimize impact on the environment. Visiting Patagonia offers an opportunity to connect with some of the most striking natural landscapes on Earth. Whether you're drawn to the towering mountains, glacial beauty, 
or wide open plains, Patagonia promises a once in a lifetime adventure. Bariloche. San Carlos de Bariloche, commonly known as Bariloche, is a picturesque city located in the Andes Mountains of Argentina's Patagonia region. Known for its stunning alpine scenery, pristine lakes, and Swiss style architecture, Bariloche is a popular destination for outdoor enthusiasts, nature lovers, and those looking to enjoy both relaxation and adventure. Here's an overview of Bariloche. Location. Bariloche is situated in the Nahuel Huapi National Park in the province of Rio Negro. It's located on the shores of Lake Nahuel Huapi and surrounded by the Andes Mountains. Alpine Architecture The city's architecture is reminiscent of a Swiss alpine village. With wooden chalets and charming buildings. This unique style adds to the city's character and charm. Natural Beauty Bariloche is famous for its breathtaking natural beauty. The surrounding landscapes feature snow-capped mountains, pristine lakes, lush forests, and meadows. The views are especially stunning from viewpoints like Cerro Campanario and Cerro Auto. Lake Noel Huapi The large and crystal-clear Lake Noel Huapi offers opportunities for various water activities such as kayaking, sailing, fishing, and swimming. There are also boat tours available to explore the lake's islands and surrounding landscapes. Cerro Catedral one of the most popular ski resorts in South America. Cerro Catedral attracts skiers and snowboarders during the winter months. In the summer, it's a great place for hiking and mountain biking. Chocolate Capital Bariloche is known as the chocolate capital of Argentina. You'll find numerous chocolate shops offering a wide variety of artisanal chocolates, truffles, and treats. Hiking and Trekking The region around Bariloche offers a plethora of hiking trails suitable for all levels of hikers. Trails like Circuito Chico and Refugio Frey are popular options. Cycling The Circuito Chico Loop is a popular route for cyclists, offering stunning lake and mountain views. Mountain biking enthusiasts can also find challenging trails in the surrounding areas. Array of outdoor activities Beyond skiing and hiking, Bariloche offers activities such as horseback riding, rock climbing, paragliding, and fly fishing. Craft beer scene In recent years, Bariloche has developed a thriving craft beer scene. With microbreweries producing a wide range of beers to enjoy after a day of outdoor activities. Local cuisine. The region's cuisine often features locally sourced ingredients. Try dishes like traditional Argentine barbecue, asado, and local specialties such as trout from the lakes and regional cheeses. Cultural heritage. Bariloche is also known for its Mapuche indigenous influence and has cultural centers where you can learn about the local indigenous history and traditions. Bariloche's combination of stunning natural landscapes, outdoor activities, charming architecture, and local flavors make it a year-round destination that appeals to a wide range of travelers seeking both relaxation and adventure. Mendoza Mendoza is a province located in the west of Argentina. Renowned for its wine production, stunning landscapes, and outdoor activities. The provincial capital, also named Mendoza, is a vibrant city that serves as a gateway to the region's attractions. Here's an overview of Mendoza. Wine Country Mendoza is one of the most important wine regions in Argentina and South America. The province is known for its Malbec wines, and you'll find numerous wineries, bodegas, offering tours and tastings. The regions of Maipú, Lajan de Cuyo, and Valle de Uco are particularly famous for their wineries. Vineyard Landscapes The scenic vineyards are set against the backdrop of the Andes Mountains, creating a picturesque setting for wine tours and tastings. The region's terroir and climate contribute to the quality of the wines produced. Wine Tourism Visitors can enjoy guided tours of wineries, where you can learn about the winemaking process, explore vineyards, and sample a variety of wines. Some wineries also offer gourmet dining experiences. Aconcagua the highest peak in the Americas, Mount Aconcagua, is located within the province. While climbing Aconcagua is a challenging endeavor and requires preparation. The surrounding landscapes are stunning and offer various trekking routes for adventurers. Outdoor Activities Mendoza offers a range of outdoor activities, including hiking, horseback riding, mountain biking, and whitewater rafting. The Andes Mountains provide a backdrop for these adventures. Hot Springs Mendoza is home to natural hot springs that provide a relaxing experience. The thermal waters are said to have therapeutic properties and are a popular destination for wellness seekers. City of Mendoza 
The provincial capital is a lively city with tree-lined streets, plazas, and an array of dining and entertainment options. The Plaza Independencia is the city's main square and a focal point for locals and tourists. Cultural events. Mendoza hosts various cultural events throughout the year, including festivals, music concerts, and art exhibitions. The National Grape Harvest Festival is a major annual celebration that showcases the region's wine culture. Olive oil production. In addition to wine, Mendoza produces high-quality olive oil. Olive oil tastings and tours are also available at local olive farms. Regional cuisine. Mendoza's cuisine often features locally sourced ingredients. You can enjoy traditional Argentine dishes, as well as regional specialties such as empanadas, locro, a hearty stew, and goat cheese. Mendoza offers a unique blend of wine tourism, adventure activities, and natural beauty. Whether you're interested in exploring vineyards, embarking on outdoor adventures, or simply soaking in the stunning landscapes, Mendoza provides a diverse and enriching travel experience. Salta. Salta is a captivating province located in the northwest of Argentina. Known for its colonial architecture, rich cultural heritage, and stunning landscapes. The provincial capital, also named Salta, is a historic city that offers a blend of traditional and modern experiences. Here's an overview of Salta. Colonial architecture. The city of Salta boasts a charming colonial architecture with well-preserved buildings. Cobblestone streets, and ornate churches. The main square, Plaza 9 de Julio, is a hub of activity and surrounded by historic structures. Cultural Heritage Salta is deeply rooted in its cultural heritage. You can explore museums, galleries, and cultural centers that showcase the region's history, indigenous cultures, and traditions. Cafayate This small town located within the province is renowned for its wine production. Cafayate's vineyards produce high-quality Torrentes white wine and you can visit wineries, enjoy tastings, and take in the scenic landscapes. Andean Landscapes The province of Salta is characterized by diverse landscapes, including the rugged Andes Mountains, colorful rock formations, and the high-altitude Quebrada de Umuaca Valley. Train to the Clouds The Trenolas New Base, Train to the Clouds, is a famous tourist attraction that offers a scenic train journey through the Andes, reaching altitudes of over 13,000 feet. The route offers breathtaking views of the landscapes. Gaucho Culture Salta is known for its strong gaucho, cowboy, culture. And you can experience this heritage through folk music, traditional dances, and cultural festivals. Local Cuisine Salta's cuisine is characterized by its regional flavors. You can savor dishes such as empanadas saltinas, regional meat turnovers, locro, a hearty stew, and tamales. Quebrada de Cafayate this stunning canyon near Cafayate features unique rock formations in various colors. Sculpted by centuries of erosion. It's a picturesque natural attraction that's worth exploring. Cultural Festivals Salta hosts various cultural events and festivals throughout the year. Celebrating music, dance, and local traditions. The Festival Nacional de la Tradición in San Antonio de los Cobras is a major gaucho festival. Handicrafts Salta is known for its handicrafts, including textiles, ceramics, and traditional woven items. You can find these products in local markets and shops. Salta offers a blend of history, culture, natural beauty, and a strong sense of regional identity. Whether you're exploring the charming city, venturing into the Andean landscapes, or immersing yourself in local traditions, Salta provides a unique and enriching travel experience. Ushuaia. Ushuaia, often referred to as the end of the world, is a city located at the southernmost tip of Argentina and is the capital of Tierra del Fuego province. Situated on the shores of the Beagle Channel and surrounded by stunning landscapes, Ushuaia is known for its unique geographical location, natural beauty, and opportunities for outdoor adventures. Here's an overview of Ushuaia. Geographical Significance Ushuaia is often called the end of the world because it's the southernmost city in the world. Located at the southern tip of South America, it's a gateway to the Antarctic region and serves as a starting point for many expeditions to Antarctica. Beagle Channel The city is situated along the Beagle Channel, a picturesque waterway that offers opportunities for boat tours, wildlife watching, and visits to nearby islands. Tierra del Fuego National Park This stunning national park is located just outside Ushuaia and offers a variety of hiking trails, stunning landscapes, 
and opportunities to explore the unique flora and fauna of the region. Glacier Marshall A popular destination for outdoor activities, Glacier Marshall can be reached via a chairlift and offers panoramic views of the city and surrounding mountains. In winter, it's a popular spot for skiing and snowboarding. Adventure Activities Ushuaia is a hub for adventure enthusiasts. You can enjoy activities such as trekking, kayaking, horseback riding, and even dog sledding in the winter months. Penguin Colonies Ushuaia is a great place to embark on boat tours to nearby islands where you can observe colonies of penguins, including Magellanic and Genda penguins. Antarctic Expeditions Many cruise ships depart from Ushuaia to explore the Antarctic region. These expeditions provide a unique opportunity to witness the breathtaking landscapes and wildlife of the southernmost continent. Maritime and Prison Museum Ushuaia was originally a penal colony, and you can learn about its history at the Maritime and Prison Museum, housed in an old prison building. Cuisine Ushuaia offers a variety of seafood and regional dishes. You can enjoy fresh seafood, as well as traditional Argentine cuisine. Lighthouse at the end of the world the historic Le Eclairer's Lighthouse, often referred to as the Lighthouse at the End of the World, is a well-known landmark in the Beagle Channel. Scenic Beauty Ushuaia is surrounded by stunning landscapes, including snow-capped mountains, glaciers, and fjords. The unique lighting and dramatic scenery make it a photographer's paradise. Ushuaia's remote location, natural beauty, and opportunities for adventure make it a captivating destination for those seeking a unique travel experience in one of the world's most intriguing settings. Cordoba Cordoba is a province located in the central region of Argentina. Known for its rich history, vibrant culture, and diverse landscapes. The provincial capital, also named Cordoba, is the second largest city in the country and a hub of education and culture. Here's an overview of Cordoba. Historical Significance Córdoba is one of the oldest cities in Argentina and played a significant role in the country's colonial history. The city's architecture reflects its colonial past. With historic churches, plazas, and buildings. Universities and education. Córdoba is home to some of Argentina's most prestigious universities, earning it the nickname La Doctor, the Learned. The National University of Córdoba, founded in 1613, is one of the oldest universities in the Americas. Colonial Architecture. The city of Córdoba features charming colonial architecture, including the Jesuit block and Estancias of Córdoba, the Cathedral, the Cabildo, Colonial Government Building, and the Manzana Jesuitica, Jesuit block, are prominent landmarks. Sierras de Córdoba The province is known for its scenic landscapes, particularly the Sierras de Córdoba mountain range. This area offers opportunities for outdoor activities such as hiking, horseback riding, and rock climbing. Villa Carlos Paz a popular tourist destination located near Córdoba City. Villa Carlos Paz is known for its beautiful lake, theaters, and vibrant nightlife. Craftsmanship Córdoba is known for its artisans who create traditional crafts such as pottery, leather goods, and textiles. The city's Feria de las Pulgas, flea market, is a great place to find unique handcrafted items. Folk music and dance Córdoba is an important center for Argentine folk music. The city hosts the National Folklore Festival, one of the largest folk music festivals in the country. Gaucho Traditions The region has a strong gaucho, cowboy, culture, and you can experience this heritage through traditional music, dances, and rodeo events. Cuisine Cordoba offers a variety of culinary delights, including regional specialties such as locro, a hearty stew, empanadas, and traditional Argentine barbecue, asado. Nightlife Córdoba has a lively nightlife scene, thanks in part to its student population. The city offers a variety of bars, clubs, and entertainment venues. Natural Reserves and Parks Córdoba boasts several natural reserves and parks, providing opportunities for ecotourism and wildlife observation. Festivals The city hosts a variety of cultural events and festivals throughout the year. Celebrating music, dance, and local traditions. Cordoba's blend of history, culture, natural beauty, and vibrant city life make it a multifaceted destination that caters to a range of interests. From history buffs to outdoor adventurers to those seeking cultural experiences. Valdez Peninsula The Valdez Peninsula, Peninsula Valdez, is located on the Atlantic coast of Argentina, in the northeastern part of the Chubut province. 
known for its rich biodiversity and unique ecosystems. The peninsula is a haven for wildlife enthusiasts and nature lovers. Here's an overview of the Valdez Peninsula. Natural Diversity The Valdez Peninsula is renowned for its diverse and abundant wildlife. It's home to a variety of marine mammals, bird species, and other wildlife. Marine Mammals One of the main attractions of the peninsula is its populations of marine mammals. The area is particularly famous for its southern right whale watching. As the whales come to the protected waters of the peninsula's bays to breed and give birth. Orcas, killer whales, are also known to hunt marine mammals in a unique way known as beach hunting. Puerto Pyramides This small town serves as a gateway to the Valdez Peninsula and is a popular base for whale watching tours and other marine wildlife excursions. Wildlife Viewing The peninsula offers opportunities for wildlife observation, including sea lions, elephant seals, Magellanic penguins, and various bird species. There are designated viewing areas and guided tours available. Sea Lion Colonies you can witness the playful interactions of sea lions at the peninsula's colonies, where these marine mammals congregate in large numbers. Magellanic Penguins Punta Tambo, located near the Valdez Peninsula, is home to one of the largest Magellanic penguin colonies in the world. Visitors can walk among the penguins in their natural habitat. Bird Watching The peninsula is an important site for bird watching, with numerous bird species inhabiting the coastal and wetland areas. Wildlife Conservation the Valdez Peninsula is recognized for its conservation efforts aimed at protecting and preserving the region's unique ecosystems and wildlife populations. Diverse Landscapes In addition to its wildlife, the peninsula boasts diverse landscapes, including coastal cliffs, sandy beaches, and salt flats. Seasonal Variations The best time to visit the Valdez Peninsula depends on the wildlife you want to observe. Whale watching is best from June to December, while penguin colonies are active from September to April. Ecotourism The region is committed to sustainable tourism practices, ensuring that visitors have the opportunity to experience its natural wonders while minimizing impact on the environment. The Valdez Peninsula is a remarkable destination for experiencing wildlife in their natural habitats, especially marine mammals and bird species. Whether you're captivated by the sight of whales, the antics of sea lions, or the charm of penguins, the peninsula offers a unique and unforgettable nature experience. El Shelton El Shelton is a small village located in the southern Patagonian Andes of Argentina. Within Los Glaciares National Park, it is renowned as the trekking capital of Argentina and is a popular destination for outdoor enthusiasts, hikers, and nature lovers. Here's an overview of El Shelton. Trekking and Hiking El Shelton is surrounded by stunning landscapes and offers a variety of hiking and trekking trails that cater to different skill levels. The village is the starting point for many iconic trekking routes, including those that lead to the majestic Mount Fitzroy and Cerro Torre. Mount Fitzroy One of the most recognizable peaks in the Andes. Mount Fitzroy is a prominent feature of the region's skyline. The trek to Laguna de los Tres offers breathtaking views of this iconic mountain. Cerro Torre Another famous peak in the area, Cerro Torre is a challenging and rewarding trek that takes you to the base of the mountain and offers stunning vistas. Laguna Capri A relatively short hike from El Shelton, Laguna Capri provides panoramic views of the surrounding mountains and is a popular camping spot. Laguna Torre This trek takes you to the picturesque Laguna Torre, where you can see the glacial lake and the impressive Cerro Torre. Viedma Glacier While not as famous as Perito Moreno Glacier, Viedma Glacier offers boat tours that take you close to the glacier's ice walls, providing a unique perspective. Bird watching. The area around El Shelton is a haven for bird watchers, with various bird species inhabiting the region's forests and wetlands. Natural beauty. El Shelton is surrounded by breathtaking landscapes, including mountains, glaciers, lakes, and rivers. The pristine natural beauty is a draw for photographers and nature enthusiasts. Camping. Camping is a popular way to experience the wilderness of the region. There are designated camping areas along the trekking routes. Seasonal Considerations The best time to visit El Shelton for trekking is during the warmer months from October to April. The weather can be unpredictable, so it's important to be prepared for changing conditions. Ecotourism El Shelton promotes eco-friendly tourism practices to preserve the natural environment and minimize the impact of visitors. Small Village Charm El Shelton is a cozy and relaxed village with a small population. It offers a range of accommodations, 
dining options, and shops catering to travelers' needs. El Shelton offers a unique opportunity to explore some of the most spectacular trekking routes and natural landscapes in Patagonia. Whether you're a seasoned hiker or simply looking to immerse yourself in nature, the village and its surroundings provide an unforgettable adventure. These are just a few of the many incredible places to visit in Argentina. The country's diversity in landscapes and culture ensures that there's something for every type of traveler. Nature of Argentina Argentina boasts a diverse and stunning range of natural landscapes. Thanks to its vast size and varied geography. From majestic mountains to expansive grasslands, lush rainforests to arid deserts, Argentina's natural beauty is truly captivating. Here are some of the prominent natural features and ecosystems in the country. Andes Mountains The western border of Argentina is dominated by the Andes, the longest mountain range in the world. This region is home to towering peaks, glaciers, and high-altitude lakes. The Andes provide opportunities for mountaineering, trekking, and adventure sports. Patagonia The southern region of Argentina includes the Patagonian steppe, characterized by vast grasslands, scrub vegetation, and unique wildlife. The area is punctuated by rugged mountains, glacial lakes, and the iconic Perito Moreno Glacier. Pampas The fertile Pampas region covers a significant portion of central Argentina. These grasslands are renowned for their cattle ranches and agricultural activities. The Pampas are also home to wetlands and lagoons that support diverse bird and wildlife species. Iguazu Falls Situated on the border with Brazil, Iguazu Falls is one of the world's most impressive waterfall systems. The falls are surrounded by lush rainforest, creating a unique ecosystem rich in biodiversity. Quebrada de Umuaca Located in the northwest, this narrow mountain valley is known for its colorful rock formations and unique geological features. It offers a glimpse into Argentina's geological history. Lake District In northern Patagonia, the Lake District is characterized by numerous glacial lakes nestled among forested mountains. This area offers opportunities for water sports, hiking, and relaxation. Atlantic Coast Argentina's coastline stretches along the Atlantic Ocean, offering sandy beaches, coastal cliffs, and vibrant fishing communities. The Valdez Peninsula is a prominent feature along this coast, known for its diverse marine life. Desert Regions The northwest of Argentina includes arid landscapes and desert regions such as the Salinas Grand Salt Flats. These areas are characterized by unique geological formations and cactus-studded landscapes. Tierra del Fuego This region at the southern tip of Argentina includes rugged landscapes, fjords, and dramatic coastlines. It's also home to the city of Ushuaia, often called the end of the world. Asteros del Ibera This vast wetland ecosystem in northeastern Argentina is one of the world's largest. It's home to a diverse range of wildlife, including capybaras, caimans, and numerous bird species. Argentina's natural diversity makes it a paradise for outdoor enthusiasts, nature lovers, and ecotourists. From exploring pristine wilderness areas to marveling at breathtaking natural wonders, visitors can experience a wide array of natural beauty within the country's borders. Foods of Argentina Argentina is famous for its rich and diverse culinary traditions. Influenced by its history, geography, and cultural heritage, here are some of the most notable Argentine foods. Asado Asado refers to the traditional Argentine barbecue, where various cuts of beef, and sometimes other meats like sausages and ribs, are cooked over an open flame or on a grill. It's a social event often accompanied by gatherings of family and friends. Empanadas These savory pastries are filled with a variety of ingredients, such as ground meat, cheese, vegetables, or even sweet fillings like dulce de leche. Empanadas are a popular street food and snack. Milanesa Similar to a breaded and fried cutlet, the milanesa is often made with beef but can also be prepared with chicken or pork. It's typically served with mashed potatoes, a salad, or in a sandwich known as a milanesa a la napolitana. Dulce de leche This sweet caramel-like spread is made from milk and sugar. And it's a staple in Argentine desserts. It's used as a filling for pastries, cakes, and cookies or simply spread on toast. Mate While not a food, mate is a traditional Argentine beverage. It's a type of herbal tea made from the leaves of the yerba mate plant. Sharing mate is a social and cultural practice that involves using a special gourd and a metal straw called a bombilla. Choripan This popular street food is a chorizo sausage grilled and served in a crusty bread roll. 
It's often accompanied by chimichurri sauce, a tangy mixture of herbs, garlic, vinegar, and oil. Provolita A simple and delicious appetizer, provolita is a melted and grilled provolone cheese topped with oregano, chili flakes, and sometimes tomatoes or onions. Pizza Argentine pizza has its own unique style, often featuring a thick and doughy crust. Common toppings include ham, cheese, olives, and sliced hard-boiled eggs. Humita Humita is a dish made from fresh corn that's grated and mixed with spices, onions, and cheese. The mixture is then wrapped in corn husks and steamed or boiled. Locro A hearty stew, locro is made with corn, beans, meat, usually pork, and vegetables. It's a traditional dish often enjoyed during colder months. Matambar a la pizza. This dish consists of thin slices of beef, matambar, cooked on a grill and topped with tomato sauce, cheese, and other toppings, resembling a pizza. Ravioles. Argentine-style ravioli is a pasta dish filled with various ingredients such as cheese, spinach, or meat. It's typically served with a tomato-based sauce. These are just a few examples of the delicious foods you can find in Argentina. The country's cuisine is a reflection of its culture, traditions, and the high-quality meat and agricultural products it produces. People of Argentina Argentina is a culturally rich and diverse country with a population that has been shaped by a variety of historical, ethnic, and social influences. Here's an overview of the people of Argentina. Ethnicity and Ancestry The majority of the population is of European descent, with significant contributions from Spanish and Italian immigrants. Many Argentines also have German, French, British, and other European roots. Indigenous peoples, including the Mapuche and Guarani, also contribute to the country's ethnic diversity, particularly in the northern regions. Cultural Identity Argentines have a strong national identity and take pride in their country's cultural heritage. This includes a passion for tango music and dance, a love for soccer, known as football in Argentina and a rich literary tradition that includes famous authors like Jorge Luis Borges. Language Spanish is the official language of Argentina. The Argentine accent and vocabulary can vary from standard Spanish due to regional influences and the country's history of immigration. Religion The predominant religion in Argentina is Roman Catholicism, influenced by the country's Spanish colonial history. However, Argentina is also home to various other religious communities, including Protestantism. Judaism, Islam, and indigenous spiritual beliefs. Urbanization. The majority of the population lives in urban areas, with Buenos Aires being the largest city and economic hub of the country. Other major cities include Córdoba, Rosario, and Mendoza. Socioeconomic diversity. Argentina experiences a range of socioeconomic disparities. While the country has a relatively high standard of living compared to some of its neighbors, there are still economic challenges and disparities in wealth distribution. Cultural diversity. The cultural diversity in Argentina is reflected in its festivals, traditions, and cuisine. Different regions have their own unique customs and celebrations, contributing to the rich cultural tapestry of the country. Immigration. Argentina has historically been a destination for immigrants, particularly in the late 19th and early 20th centuries. Waves of immigrants from Europe, including Italy and Spain, contributed to shaping the country's demographic makeup. Political engagement. Argentines are known for their active political engagement and strong opinions on a wide range of issues. The country has a history of political activism and demonstrations. Social relationships. Family is central to Argentine culture, and many people maintain close relationships with extended family members. Social gatherings and community activities are important aspects of Argentine life. Overall, the people of Argentina are known for their warmth, hospitality, and passion for their culture and traditions. The diversity of ethnic backgrounds, combined with a unique Argentine identity, has created a dynamic and vibrant society. Beaches of Argentina Argentina's coastline stretches along the South Atlantic Ocean, offering a variety of beautiful beaches that cater to different preferences. From tranquil shores to vibrant beach towns, here are some notable beaches in Argentina. Mar del Plata One of Argentina's most popular beach destinations. Mar del Plata is a bustling coastal city with numerous beaches. From family-friendly shores to those ideal for water sports enthusiasts. Playa Grande is one of the city's most famous beaches. Pinamar Known for its sandy dunes and pine forests. 
Pinamar is a trendy beach town that attracts both locals and tourists seeking relaxation and outdoor activities. Villa Gazelle. This beach town is known for its wide, sandy beaches and laid-back atmosphere. It's a popular destination for families and young travelers looking to unwind. Carrillo. Another charming coastal town, Carrillo features picturesque beaches surrounded by sand dunes and forests. It's a peaceful getaway known for its upscale accommodations. Las Grutas. Located in Patagonia, Las Grutas offers unique beaches with cliffs and caves along the coastline. The warm waters of the Gulf of San Matias make it a great spot for swimming. Miramar. Known for its long beachfront promenade and family-friendly atmosphere. Miramar is a classic Argentine beach destination. Nakakia. This beach town boasts a wide beach area that's perfect for long walks and horseback riding. It's a great place to enjoy the natural beauty of the Argentine coastline. Costa del Est. Characterized by a peaceful ambience and lush vegetation. Costa del Est is a small coastal town that's perfect for relaxation. Santa Teresita. This family-oriented beach destination offers a range of activities for all ages. Including water sports, amusement parks, and cultural events. San Clemente del Tuyu. With its long stretches of sandy beaches and proximity to natural reserves. This town offers a mix of relaxation and outdoor adventures. Mar de las Pampas. A coastal village known for its pristine beaches and tranquil atmosphere. Mar de las Pampas is a great place to escape the city and enjoy nature. Mar Azul. Nestled within a dense forest. Mar Azul provides a unique setting where beach and wilderness meet. It's a peaceful destination with an emphasis on ecotourism. These are just a few examples of the many beautiful beaches you can find along Argentina's coastline. Whether you're looking for vibrant beach towns or more secluded shores. Argentina offers a diverse range of options for beach enthusiasts. Nightlife in Argentina. Argentina's nightlife is renowned for its vibrancy, diversity, and late hours. From bustling cities to cultural hotspots, you'll find a wide range of entertainment options that cater to various tastes and preferences. Here's an overview of the nightlife scene in Argentina. Buenos Aires. As the capital and largest city, Buenos Aires boasts a dynamic nightlife that rivals some of the world's top nightlife destinations. The city offers everything from tango shows and live music venues to trendy bars, nightclubs, and cultural events. The neighborhoods of Palermo, San Telmo, and Recoleta are particularly known for their nightlife. Tango shows. Argentina is the birthplace of tango, and experiencing a tango show is a must for visitors. Many venues offer dinner and tango performances where you can immerse yourself in the sensuous dance and music. Live music. Buenos Aires and other major cities have a thriving live music scene. Featuring a variety of genres from rock and jazz to electronic and traditional folk music. Venues like Nicedo Club and La Trastienda are famous for hosting live music performances. Bars and pubs. Argentina is known for its bar culture, where locals often gather in the evening to enjoy drinks and conversations. Bars range from traditional and classic to modern and trendy. Palermo Soho and Palermo Hollywood in Buenos Aires are known for their abundance of bars. Nightclubs. Nightclubs in Argentina are famous for starting late and going until the early hours of the morning. In Buenos Aires, you'll find clubs offering different music styles. From electronic dance music to Latin beats. Cultural events. Argentina's cultural scene comes alive at night with theaters, art galleries, and cultural centers hosting various performances, exhibitions, and events. Teatro Colón in Buenos Aires is renowned for its opera and ballet performances. Casinos. For those interested in gambling and entertainment. Argentina has several casinos. Mar del Plata and Puerto Madero in Buenos Aires are popular casino destinations. Outdoor events. During the warmer months, various outdoor events take place. Including open-air concerts, festivals, and night markets. These events often feature live music, food stalls, and art exhibitions. Late night dining. In Argentina, dinner is often served late, and many restaurants open their doors until well past midnight. After a night out, you can enjoy a hearty meal at a parilla, steakhouse, or a traditional Argentine restaurant. Festivals and celebrations. Argentina hosts a variety of festivals and celebrations throughout the year. Featuring music, dance, and cultural displays. Carnival celebrations in cities like Gualeguaychú are particularly lively. Remember that nightlife in Argentina starts late, with many venues only becoming lively after midnight. 
It's also important to exercise caution and be aware of your surroundings, especially when moving around at night. As with any destination, local recommendations and safety tips can enhance your nightlife experience in Argentina. We made travel videos for you with very hard effort. We need your support, God bless you. Please like and share our video with your friends. And write a cute comments for us. And don't forget to subscribe our channel. Thanks again with core of heart. Have a nice day. God bless you.